Here's to Freeland answering questions with a lecture. Hi, I'm Brian Lilly, political columnist for the Toronto Sun. I'm going to show you an unbelievable exchange that took place at the House of Commons Finance Committee. Christy Freeland, Canada's Minister of Finance, was before the Finance Committee. She's supposed to answer questions while she's there, but when Conservative MP Philip Lawrence, who represents the Peterborough area, when he was asking basic questions to the Finance Minister on what the GDP per capita was in this country, she didn't want to answer. He asked her several times, and then, in an act of frustration, asked her, could she just answer for any of the last three quarters what the GDP per capita was. Check out the exchange. What was, GD, what was the GDP per capita in the first quarter, the second quarter, or the third quarter? Any quarter. Mr. Lawrence, you and I actually have had very respectful exchanges, and I'm grateful for that. But I have to say, after your leader's performance last week, where he jumped to accusations of terrorism, Seriously? alarming all Canadians, and after the vote of your party to fail to support Ukraine, order, chair. it is a Point bit order, chair. rich. Now, Freeland could have easily given an answer, or she could have turned to one of her officials and asked for the number, or looked it up in the big binder that they always carry with them to such meetings. She didn't do that, though. She didn't want to answer the question. She wanted to go at that small ball attack that the Liberals have been playing on the Conservatives with the help of the media for the last week. Answering a question about the GDP per capita going down, about Canadians getting poorer by saying, you don't support Ukraine, you didn't vote for the free trade deal that we, we uh, want to update with them. That is, that is petty politics. And it, it's beneath the Minister of Finance. The truth is she didn't want to answer because the GDP per capita in Canada is falling. It's at one of the worst rates of decline compared to the United States in years. In US dollar terms, the average American, it, it's a GDP per capita of $70,000, US dollars. In Canada, it's 51,000 US dollars. We are poorer than our neighbors and it's getting worse because the economy sluggish, because our economic growth isn't keeping up with our population growth because of bad economic policies brought in by this Liberal government. But Freeland doesn't want to answer the question because she knows it will lead to more questions about her poor performance. Drop a comment down below, let me know what you think. Share this on social media, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel.